Hi, welcome to the Reptilia's Reptile Den. Um, I am going to be doing a setting up video for my new addition to the household. I bought this little kit for now, just in the meantime until I can get a better, more custom kit for her. Um, so I'm going to be actually setting this up for her. Um, so here we go. Okay, so what I'm going to do first is I'm going to thoroughly clean this aquarium. Um, thoroughly rinse it down and everything. Make sure there's nothing in here harmful um, because it's been sitting on a pet store shelf. And, you know, people like touching and grabbing things. So I'm going to make sure it's thoroughly cleaned. The next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to take all her little hides, which I got this little piece of cork bark, I think it's called. I don't, I think it's cork bark. It feels like cork bark. Looks like it. Um, I'm going to take this and I'm going to take, and I'm also going to take this, which I bought this for her. So maybe she can hide under and stuff, you know, give her a little hideaway, you know, just in case she gets too overwhelmed seeing everybody walk by and stuff, you know, so she has a little place to get away and be like, oh, I don't see them anymore. So they can't see me, you know? I don't know why I did that. Um, well, yeah, I will be back shortly and we will put this thing together because I'm going to actually take these pieces and while I'm doing everything, I'm going to actually boil it in some hot water in a pan. Um, it's clearly fogging up, but yes, I'm going to boil these in a hot thing of water on the stove. So that way, all the bacteria, anything that's on these, you know, will actually get off of them by boiling them. Because, like, I had someone tell me that, that they boil all their hides and huts and stuff. So, when all that gets done, I will come back and we will put this, um, her little habitat together. So, I will see you guys shortly. Hello, um, I'm back from cleaning the aquarium. Um, her hides and cork bark is still, is still boiling. I haven't, I put them on the stove and everything and I'm waiting for them to boil, you know. The reason I'm laughing is, um, I hear this one chewing on her toy in the background. You chewing on your toy? You have fun chewing on your toy? He is. Okay. Okay. Now, alright, we're gonna see if I can get this in a better angle. Oh, um, this and this. I'm gonna bring this over. Okay. Can I help you, sir? Sir, can I help you? Okay. <laughs> That's great. This is Evie. Can you move? <laughs> can you move? Okay. And this is probably gonna be fun trying to set this up. Um, I took this. It's a little lock thing that you can actually put in it. It's pretty cool. Okay. So, I love the fact that it's a sliding one. It makes me happy. And her aquarium is thoroughly cleaned. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to open this soil that came with it. Um, it's uh, the creature... Cause like I said, for the time being, this is what I'm going to use, um, just until I can buy some better stuff, you know. Um, so, I'm going to put the soil in here. I'm going to put it all in here. This is not for you. <sighs> not everything is for you. You think everything is for you. I'm going to spread it around a little bit. I know you can't really see me doing that. So here, I'm going to put the aquarium on my lap. You're going to have to see my ugly feet. And I'm sorry about that. Can you go on somewhere? Okay. So I'm going to spread the soil around. 
Kind of make it even a little bit. Um, yeah, looks pretty even. Pretty good to me. I couldn't get the sticker off all the way and it's bothering me. I'm going to put... Okay. I'm going to put this little water bowl. It's a Zilla product. Um, I'm not sponsored by Zilla, but hey, Zilla, if you want to throw me a little sponsorship my way, uh, I won't complain. Um, but yeah, it's a little Zilla water bowl. Um, I have one for my Crested Gecko, um, and now I have one for her, which I'm not revealing on what she is yet until she goes in her enclosure. So I'm going to put it like in the corner over here. Kind of bury it a little bit, you know, so she don't try to knock it over or anything. And that way she won't have to, you know, try to struggle to get her water. Um, I'm going to put a little thermometer in here. This will do until I can get the thermometer I want. Um, and this is also, this is a Zoomed. Zoomed, Ecoterra, um, Zilla. Uh, if y'all want to throw a little sponsorship my way, I don't have no problem. I will review your products and everything for you. If you want to throw me that little sponsorship my way, I mean, I'm just saying. Um, and I'm going to put this in the corner over here. Ah, it's a little crooked, but hey gonna do until I can get a huge thermometer and humidity gauge like I really want um let me see if the hides and cork bark are done boiling and cleaning and we'll be back to put the cork bark and everything in here and then we will put her in here and let's see how she'll like her enclosure I will be back you guys okay now everything has been boiled, cooled off, so nothing's hot to the touch. It won't hurt the baby. Um, so now we are gonna put the stuff, put the stuff in here. Comes with a little lock. I don't know if I mentioned that already. All right, I'm gonna put her Heidi hut over here. Put it in the ground a little bit, like I did with the water bowl. And then we'll put the little coconut bark, cork, whatever. Yes, I see you, baby. We will put like the coconut bark over here near her water bowl. We'll also like dig a little hole for this. So she really can't go under this. It'll just give her probably something to web up, you know. And I, oh, I may have just gave the secret away. Oh, wheels. Um, and let me get my water that's already treated with rep to save. I water all my reptiles with their water that's been treated with the rep to save. So none of the chemicals from your tap water will hurt them. Um, so let's try to do this without getting her soil wet. Can I help you, Evie? Well, well, okay. There we go. This just got some water now. Can I help you, Mio? I'm gonna need you to get out of the way. It's sad because for once, Groot is being a good boy. Alrighty. So, let's move this out of the way. I don't know where y'all are barking at, but you need to stop. Evie! Move, bro. <sighs> so, I'm gonna close this because I'm gonna get closer to the camera to show you what I got. I'm gonna booty scoot. So, I got this cute little girl. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and open this just in case she gets too spooked. Um, first time owning one of these, so oh, I'm a little nervous, as you can kind of tell. 
Oh. Hi. Hi. Oh. It is a Arizona blonde. Oh, I'm a little nervous. Let's see if she will come out and crawl into my hand. I'm going to do it over her. Oh, that's okay. Here. It's okay. I'm conquering a fear of spiders because I actually am scared of spiders. So. Hmm. Hmm. I'm a little nervous. Oh. I'm okay. I don't want her to shoot her eradicating hairs. I probably butchered that name. Oh. Yeah, come on. Nor do I want her to bite me. Um, I may just shake her off in the container for now. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I don't want the soil to land on her and get her. So, she's pretty. Oh. Alright, come on, girl. Just giving her her own time. Come on. She does make me a little nervous. <laughs> Oh no, that's the Anne's got staples. So we're going to do it this way. So, let us try this way. Come on. Come on. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god, everyone, I'm holding a fucking spider. did it by myself. I'm proud. Yes. Okay. We're good. I'm okay. I feel like my heart is about to come out of my chest right now though, but we're good. We got her out. Oh, my chest hurts. Mm. <laughs> Cause the last couple times I have held her well, it's only been twice that I've held her. Um, the guy that I bought her from actually put her in my hands. So, I don't know how to actually pick her up. So, just wanted to scooch her, give her a little motivation. To, oh, there's something touching my butt. You know. But, uh, yes. This is the new addition to our household. Is a Arizona blonde. So, I will keep you updated on her, and that has been The Reptile's Den. Don't forget to like and subscribe.